was your melt sandwich? Amazing. I mean, you you know whose idea that was? Is yours? Dude, that was, well, well, come on, what do you think? If I'm asking, idea. what do you think? Yeah, it's amazing, right? It's so good. You're gonna go into a food coma in the van mm -hmm. or bus or whatever you're in, but okay, first off, has anyone had a better season than you? I think you've had a pretty good season. Pretty good season, yep. Are you happy with your season so far? Yeah, I'm happy with it. Okay, so when you look at your, you, you lead them to an Ironman title, you guys win three weights in a row at the Ironman, and then, you know, you lose the duel. You win the Ironman, lose the duel to Blair. It's going to come down to preps now. Yeah. How focused are you guys on, you got some duels here, you got to train for, but what, how focused are you guys on bringing a national title back to some? We're focused, um, definitely. Um, that duel was probably, there's a lot of things we can learn from there. Um, I don't think their team is at full strength, but it doesn't matter. Their team wasn't at full strength. Iron Man, ours wasn't at, uh, at the duel, and so everyone's going to be there at preps, and so that's when it's really going to count. And so we're looking forward to that. We need to make some improvements, and, and that's that's like Coach Green always. We put emphasis on Iron Man, but the most emphasis is at the end of the season, just kind of like a like a college tournament, like the NCAA tournament is our prep now. So everyone will be there. Everyone will be ready and. I'm looking forward to seeing how it is. It's going to be a Tar Heel, right? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you pay attention to box scores or highlights or Twitter, but last night the Tar Heels put it on. Listen, I don't know where you guys are in terms of the interview, but <laughs> I just want to let you know the biggest difference Lackland last year and Lackland this year is that he's wiped up. Okay? Whoa! Shout out, shout Whoa. out. Shout Whoa! Out, shout out to Andy wiped up. You man right here. Man. Yes! He's not wrong. He's not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> he's not wrong. Okay. Do you pay attention to box scores? Do you pay attention to highlights? Did you see what the Tar Heels did to the Hokies last night? It was, that was unreal. 23 yeah. to 10, was it? What was I it? I think so, yeah, 23 to 10 and Kennedy Monday. Tech fall. Um, McFadden. Performance. Yeah, unreal. McFadden's good if you didn't know that. <laughs> yeah. Like, really good. Really good, yeah. Right? So when you look at that and you know the trajectory of that program, and you know your Iron Man, and you know your season so far, is there any doubt you can't go and be an impact guy right away for Coleman Scott? No reason. I'm, I'm planning to take a gray shirt here, but we'll see. Like, after the gray shirt year, I'll come in my first year and we'll see whatever we want me to do. Um, but look at the recruiting class, right? So there's there's no doubt that that program is a rising program. And it's just, it's going to keep going. You know, when you go to some, you know, a lot of the times some, I think the, the, the goal is Ivy mm -hmm. Academies, mm -hmm. right? North Carolina is a really good school and people yeah. don't realize that. Yeah. Very good academically. What was your favorite thing about, like, when you obviously the campus is it's second to none, right? Mm -hmm. But what, what about the academics at, at, at UNC did, did you like? Um, so, first off, I want to study business. So that's why I looked at a couple of Ivies, like, I was looking at Cornell and Penn, and, um, and they have a great business group at UNC. So that's obviously something that I was academically, like, that's just as important as the rest of it. So um, getting into the business school is one of my goals, as well as having good seasons when I'm there. You know, so. I mean, that's when you go to a school and you pick business, you pick engineering, you pick a lot. That's not like a cream puff major. You know that, right? Yeah, it's very hard. So it's, it'll, you know, it'll require some work, and that's why I made it. Uh, take a great shoot to get some credit and stuff like that um, to you know, give you the best chance possible to get it. So why do people mess your name? It's Lachlan, right? Yeah. Right? They say Lachlan? People say Lachlan, Lachlan, the same in my school. I, I don't get too riled up about it. So you don't really care? Lachlan, I don't really care. Okay. Your family has, a, you got a really interesting family story. You know, and we're, we're Americans, we're all immigrants at heart, right? You know that, right? Whether it's seven generations mm -hmm. back or your dad came from UK. Mm -hmm. And then you guys, did you come through Canada? What is the whole story? So I was raised in um, Bahrain and stayed there for five, six years, then moved to um, the UAE. I lived in Abu Dhabi, which is about an hour away from, from Dubai, and so everyone knows Dubai. Uh, and I lived there for about five, six years, and then we moved over to Canada in middle school. And then from there, that's really where, like, and I had been wrestling kind of throughout my whole childhood, but nowhere, like, Abu Dhabi is nowhere in comparison to Canada. And Canada, it still really isn't in comparison to America, like, level-wise. So there was always jumps, but it wasn't until Coach Green, you know, had messaged me a little bit, and we got in contact with him until things kind of really worked out. But that was always a goal, was to, to wrestle in college, especially NCAA. Bahrain, like, where the, uh, I think it's one of the Batiroff brothers wrestles for him, yeah. right? Yeah. That, you were there. Yeah. What are your languages? What's your language skills? Like, what do you have? I know a little bit of Arabic, but not too much. Um, but um, I can speak French because my mom's French Canadian and I don't speak English. And then, that, that's so crazy. What passports do you have? Um, I have Canadian residency. I'm dual citizenship, I think, with. Uh, You're dual, right? What are the duels that you have? Your dual. With Great Britain, I believe. With what? I can hear you. Great Britain. Great Britain and here? I believe so. Oh, not here. I'm, I have a visa here. You have a visa here? Yeah. Visa, right? This blows my mind right it's, now. Uh, yeah, my dad knows all about it, but it's, it's a whole complicated. Do you want to be an American citizen? 
Yeah, I'd like to. I think it, I think it's gonna happen. I think so what do you got? Seven years, five years here now, right? Mm -hmm. Is it five years? Maybe I'm not too sure. And you gotta pass like a super easy civics test. Maybe. Yeah. Don't be a criminal, yeah. right? Exactly. Awesome, man. That's really cool. That's like a, it's a neat story to hear, right? Yeah. Awesome, man. All right, you got anything else for me? No, uh, thank you for taking the time. All right, I'm glad you enjoyed your melt. Maybe yeah. convince him to drop by melt. Mm. Maybe get a to-go a coma sandwich because I'm gonna go. If I get that, I gotta go work another term. I'll go into a coma. <laughs> All right, Lackland. Hey, thank you for the time. Good luck to you. Thank you.